Hey, welcome to my channel. My name is Ruth, and let's chat about the Midnight Feast. If you are interested in reading any like mystery murder books, then maybe this one's for you. This story is set in a Lux Coaster retreat called The Manor, and as we know, you cannot run away from your past. Some of the themes that this book goes into are um, rich versus poor. Um, they also go a little bit into um, some bird folklore, which the author, I think, ties nicely into the story. Um, and also local versus non-local drama. And what that is, is um, you have people that live there for a long time versus you have new people coming in to like redevelop and make this um, land unrecognizable you know something new and erasing the past and you know to some residents that is kind of offensive so that's what i mean by um local versus non-local drama um i don't really have any favorite characters in this book um you read from the perspectives of different characters here and um you read from the present as well as um the past so you do get a good well-rounded story here um, i also like that the author sprinkles a little bit of some clues throughout the story so if you were really paying attention you could really figure out like how everything is connected so i thought that was really well done um, the prologue was very catchy and um, the chapters in the book aren't numbered but my favorite there are titles of what's gonna be happening in that chapter um also i would say this book is also like a good dose of poetic justice and people getting their just desserts so um that's what i'm gonna say about this nice poetic justice um it did keep my attention, so I did want it to read more about like what's going to happen. Um, the one thing I was kind of like um, getting tired of was one of the characters. Um, I don't know if you would say like it's her meltdown or if it was her way of like trying to calm down. And so at a certain point, I definitely got kind of like bored of her doing that. So that was a um, only thing um, otherwise very interesting how everything's connected um, there are some twists and surprises I think in this book too um, so I would give this book a good four stars for me um, would tell you to check it out and like always you know I would love to hear from you um, did you like this book didn't you like this book who is your favorite character please comment rate share and subscribe happy reading